we don't talk about enough in harm reduction it's how is the harm reduction harm reduction when you when you make it personal and when it becomes personal what you know as when we think about harm reduction in this context of service provision or the work that we're doing and we can talk about harm reduction in this sort of removed sense and then sort of navigating that in terms of the personal and how we take care of each other and how we take care of ourselves and how we practice harm reduction principles and values and beliefs in our own personal lives when it's people that we care about or people that we know uh, who may not be clients or participants um, and how different that is. And I think that unfortunately a lot of times we are so concerned about the way that we're going to be perceived as harm reductionists of whether or not we're being non-judgmental enough or whether or not we're um, you know being true to the values of harm reduction that we avoid some really difficult important conversations about the work and about the way we engage with each other and the way that we take care of each other and we protect each other and the way that we talk to each other about things that may not be working so well when it comes to drugs and drug use. Um, and so, to me, that's something that's really important. And, you know, I've seen too many people uh, get into situations that were devastating for them, including people who are gone now because we didn't have, you know, the kinds of conversations that maybe would have helped them uh, to make changes or to think about what was going on in their lives. Um, and obviously I'm not trying to say that, you know, people died because of what of conversations that were or weren't had. You know, things happen and accidents happen and drugs are difficult. And, uh, and I think that's, those are the conversations that we don't have those enough because we're fighting so hard against a system that stigmatizes people who use drugs and because we are fighting for great reasons against that stigma and trying to pull out all of the things that are wonderful and great uh, about people who use drugs and trying to embrace all of the, the positive, which is so important and I wholeheartedly believe in, in challenging that stigma all the time. And sometimes it makes it harder internally to have authentic conversations about the harm, the real harms that are also associated with drugs and drug use. Um, and that's something I, I struggle with and I think is important that we keep exploring.